The next episode of Pokemon Horizons is gonna be absolutely crazy, dude, because already, just 55 episodes into the new series, our heroes are literally going up against the Poldera Elite Four in a series of battles, dude. All of this was revealed in the new preview trailer, and there is a lot to talk about, so let's just dive into it now. First of all, we know these Elite Four battles will be 2v2 battles, with our heroes teaming up with the gym leaders that they previously challenged. So yeah, it will be Liko Royal Dot plus a gym leader versus an Elite Four member. And in general, that's a really cool concept, dude. We don't often see gym leaders battling Elite Four members, so I'm really excited. One of the battles will be Dot and her Quaxley, and Iono and her Belly Bolt versus Poppy, and her Copperaja and her Tinkerton. Another battle will be Roy and his Fue Coco and Brassius and his Dolliv versus Hassel and his Baxcalibur and his Flapple. And then the final battle in a couple of weeks in a separate episode will be Liko and Katie versus Rika. The preview trailer for the next episode also showed Coral, Kofu, and Larry, so I'm gonna guess that we'll also see Coral and Kofu versus Larry as well. So, first of all, before we talk about anything else, let's get the possible problems with all of this out of the way now, and then we can move on to the hype exciting stuff, you know? So, we know the next episode will somehow be cramming three Elite Four battles in one episode. Roy versus Hassel, Dot versus Poppy, Coral versus Larry, and that is bound to be a huge huge issue, dude. It kinda makes it obvious that these battles are gonna be pretty rushed, unfortunately. The pacing will probably be not so great, since somehow three battles have to fit in one episode. And if I'm brutally honest, too, the preview trailer kind of showed that the animation is not really anything to write home about either. Like, the animation isn't bad, but it's not really, like, that crazy from what we saw already. But we do know that the episode after next episode is gonna be entirely focused on Liko and Katie versus Rika, so I'm assuming they're saving all of their budget, all of their animation, all of their wow factor for that battle, for that episode, you know? So yeah, Liko vs. Rika is gonna go hard, definitely. Overall, realistically, absolutely none of these newish trainers teaming up with gym leaders should be able to get even close to taking down Elite Four members, you know? That would be really, really, really weird in terms of power scaling. Dude, it would be like Kanto Ash Ketchum teaming up with Kanto Misty, and then somehow taking down Lance, you know? It really makes no sense at all, to be fair. But these are training battles, so I'm gonna assume the Elite Four members are gonna go easier on them. It's really not like the Elite Four members are gonna battle at full power like their titles are on the line. They'll probably just be taking it easy and having a bit of fun, you know? Plus, I really don't think we're gonna see, like, four plus Elite Four battles and have to witness our heroes losing every single time. So I actually think that at least one battle is gonna result in the Elite Four member losing. As surprising as that is, man. First of all, though, let's be so for real right now. We all know for a fact that Coral and Kofu versus Larry, that's absolutely gonna result in Coral and Kofu losing. I'd be willing to bet my life on that, man. Like, Coral is absolutely crazy. She is so unstable. She can never work well as a team, even with the other explorers. So yeah, for that reason, there is no way that she'll be able to work well as a team with Kofu. So I really think that Coral is gonna lose the plot as always, and then Larry is gonna absolutely decimate them, dude. And while we're talking about losses, I also think that Roy and Brassius are gonna lose against Hassel. I don't know, man, I just can't picture that little cute Fue Coco and Dolive taking down two Elite Four Pokemon. Maybe that makes me judgmental, especially since Ash's Pikachu took down the world champion. So, like, you shouldn't judge a Pokemon by their looks, you know? But simultaneously, we can all admit that Roy's Fue Coco is not quite Ash's Pikachu. Not yet, anyway. I believe in the little guy, he'll get there someday. But for now, I think Roy and Fue Coco are definitely gonna lose. We can hope and pray they'll put up a good battle at least, though, you know? So now, let's talk about Dot and Iono versus Poppy. I really think this is gonna be the battle that surprises everyone, dude. Like, realistically, although Dot and Iono probably should lose against Poppy, I do really feel like they have the biggest chance of winning out of all of these battles, you know? And that's all because Dot and Iono have been friends and colleagues and have worked together for years. Dot and Iono are really close and familiar with each other, you know? They're really on the same wavelength. I think they'll be able to work together amazing as a team, and I think that's gonna shine through.
through and allow them to defeat Poppy. Plus, in general, Dot is a more knowledgeable and skilled trainer than Liko and Roy are, and Iono is definitely a stronger gym leader than Brassius and Katie, you know? And it's also worth mentioning that Poppy's the youngest and least experienced Elite Four member, so yeah, I really feel like Dot and Iono are gonna work together amazingly as a team and defeat Poppy, man. Maybe Poppy being the youngest won't take the battle as seriously and will kind of be having fun with it. So yeah, for all of those reasons, that's what I think, you know? Overall, I do really wish that Roy was using Kilowatt Troll and Dot was using Tinker Tink. Those Pokemon really do deserve some battle focus, man. Especially since Dot's Tinker Tink versus Poppy's Tinkerton would be an awesome battle, and maybe could have led to an evolution too. But regardless, I'm just really hyped that we're getting Elite Four battles in general, man. Pokemon Horizons really keeps surprising everyone. I'll probably talk about Liko and Katie versus Rika in a video next week, since their battle isn't in the next episode. But until then, let me know your thoughts in the comments below, like and subscribe if you enjoyed, join our community Discord server, and above everything, best wishes until we meet again!